hey hello there welcome back to time Arts with b if you're a returning subscriber and if you're a new subscriber thank you so much for joining this family you can hit the subscribe button and click on the notification bell so you don't miss out on all the great content coming your way I know it's a little bit late for this kind of video but mm, I'm going to shamelessly do it anyways <laughs> because I want to share with you the things I'm going to be changing in my life in 2022. Um, I wouldn't call them a new year resolution because some of them are things I've been practicing before but I'm not consistent with but this year I want to stay consistent with them and some of them are things that I wanted to practice before but didn't really get to doing them so without further ado let me go straight into listing them the number one thing would be rest rest yeah I noticed that even when I'm resting I am thinking I am planning i am doing one thing or the other so this year i want to be intentional about resting about taking time off about vacation i might not have the luxury of going to you know flying to another state or flying to um another country for a vacation but even if it is something small something affordable i want to take our time to do it the second thing i want to do this year is look for ways to increase my mental health and i know have been um trying it um the previous years 2021 I, I know that i've really improved on being intentional about the things i listen to the kind of things i digest but i want to take it a little further this year i want to be comfortable talking with a second person like talking to someone about my mental health learning about my emotions learning about my personality and how it's shaping my life how it's affecting my day-to-day -day activity or how um it can affect affect one or two things i do so being intentional about it another thing i want to practice more this year is letting go of the need to control everything if this is not your first time on this channel you probably know that i am a to-do list kind of person like i map out every single detail and that doesn't mean that life doesn't happen and things do not go the way i want them to but that doesn't mean that the next day i will still not map it out <laughs> that is just who i am and with that kind of attitude i tend to want to control everything i i totally break down when things do not go my way and this year i want to learn how to be okay even when things are not okay like what i'm trying to say is that i don't want to have control over everything i want to understand that life is a game of guess yes i saw a quote somewhere and it's basically saying that life is a game of guessing that is one step towards helping my mental health in 2022 i want to learn how to spend on myself i'm the worst person when it comes to spending on myself i am so frugal and i am a saver basically i save a lot and i'm thinking oh there's this goal there's this thing i want to do i need to save this money i need to save this money and i do not know i do not understand the importance of spending on myself i was writing um scripting a youtube video on the importance of learning to spend on yourself the right way not overspending on yourself but like balancing it out because i've been learning a lot of things along the way L late last year one of the things i saw on someone's um status i just saw it somewhere randomly and it says that um there's part of um financial knowledge is knowing how to spend on yourself and that really caught my attention if i like something and i have the financial capacity i would go for it i'm going to get it for myself because i have learned now or i'm learning that it's part of financial knowledge yes another thing i want to do this year is write more 
um i'm very bad at writing I, I don't know i just don't like writing i i don't like it but i read a lot of books and which is um why i started this youtube channel i feel i read a lot of books and i want to share my knowledge with people but i noticed that some people would never or might never discover this youtube channel i could reach out to people through writing i want to get into the habit of documenting my process through writing when i read something write it down i'm learning how to use notion so well now that i will start um writing out summary of any book i read so that i can share it with you also this year i want to think more about impacts and um i know when i say it <laughs> when i wrote it down i was thinking uh, me creating this youtube um videos is also impacts but beyond that i want a physical impact i am someone that i'm not really relational enough i need to learn how to relate more with people and that is what i want to work on this year i want to work on connection i want to think about ways i can impact my immediate environment just look for creative ways look for groups to join connect with people reach out more to people look for ways to increase my network um that is one thing i really really want to work on this year i don't know how i'm going to go about that actually so if you have any group or any suggestion for me i would really really appreciate it please drop it in the comment section and that concludes this video thank you so much for watching till the end please share with me in the comment section also any other thing you would personally love to change in your life this year and which of the things on my list would you also practice this year please share with me in the comment section and i hope to see you in my next video 